Disgraced former politician Salim Mehia's downfall continued today as he lost a major battle regarding his opulent Sydney mansion. Salim Mehia's opulent Western Sydney mansion once featured in a rap video is about to hit the market after he lost a desperate legal bid to block it being sold from under him. The federal court on Wednesday denied Mehia's application for an injunction to block the National Australia Bank from selling two of his properties after a judge found it was an abuse of process. The former property developer was in 2018 declared bankrupt owing $24 million to creditors. The bank was now seeking to repossess and sell the two houses, including a six-bedroom, five-bathroom home featuring a Swarovski crystal chandelier, jacuzzi and private sauna. The 845-square-meter mansion was in 2017 advertised for rent at $2,950 a week and was featured in a video for U.S. rap artist Bo Wow. It also boasts a 13-car basement, home theatre complete with massage chairs. Did you know I designed, built and hand-picked every single item in the house, from the screws that are in the hinges to the light bulb luminosity, Mahaja wrote in a 2017 Instagram post after he announced he was moving out of the house and putting it up for rent. The bank is also seeking to repossess another property at nearby Anne Street. The former Auburn deputy mayor asked Justice Jane Jaggett to grant an injunction so that he could sell the properties himself, despite being in jail. Mahaja represented himself during the hearing and dialed into the court from Kuma Correctional Center where he is housed after he was earlier this year jailed for at least two years and three months for lying under oath to further his business interests. Mahaja told the court that he had been declared bankrupt owing $24 million to creditors, however he disputed that amount saying much of it was not true and correct. He told the court his debt included $10 million to the Australian Taxation Office but said $7.5 million of that was in penalties.